I, a lot of shaking up on that right side. I mean, pretty consistent throughout the year, but now it kind of seems like it's solidified a little bit. What's that mean for you on the, the left side? You're pretty far removed from it. Does that change anything for you? Does it kind of help you guys gel a little bit more? Or? Uh, not necessarily change too much for me, but like you said, yeah, it kind of gels a little bit better. Knowing that, I mean, that right side is a little more solidified and uh, having rain on there. Uh, I mean, obviously, yeah, they, they did a great job last week against TCU. I mean, obviously, it was his first, first big game, first game start, and it's nice to know that that right side is kind of kind of getting settled down. And what a, the TCU game, we saw Dengue hit a bit more than what we've seen in the past. Now, can you, can you talk a little bit about you know whether that was something you guys kind of placed on yourself, or is that something TCU is doing, or is it just kind of little breakdowns here and there, or is it just TCU just have good front seven? Yeah, I mean, um, yeah, I mean, you got to credit TCU. I mean, they're, they're got a good defense, but I mean, also uh, we'd like to be able to kind of hold our blocks longer. I mean, give give them as much time as we can. Um, I mean, obviously, sometimes you think, you think you're holding your block long enough, but, I mean, you just got to finish each play until the whistle. And uh, I think there was a few times last week where we didn't necessarily finish all the way. And, I mean, obviously, uh, Coach Gunner and Coach Shinner kind of addressed that with us as well. I mean, just kind of finishing, making sure we finish every, every single play. What about NIU? What do they bring to the table that's different than maybe what you've seen already? I mean, they got some decent experience up front. I think they're two ends, uh, both returning starters. Uh, they're, they fly around a lot. I mean, they play, play hard every play. Um, seems like they're just, just like I said, they're just kind of flying around. Um, they have kind of run some, a little similar defense. I think they run like a four-three. Um, so I mean, but I mean, they're, they got they got a decent front front seven. So. What about the you know with James coming back this week? Can you talk a little bit about the difference between the three backs and how that affects you guys up front? I mean, do you guys have to react any differently to you know a guy like you know Tony is going to get around the corner really fast or? You know, and you know, a guy like Taylor, you know, he yeah. kind of seems to do a little bit of everything, yeah. and then we don't really know what we got in James. Yeah. So. Well, I mean, I don't think it necessarily changes what we do. Um, I mean, obviously having James come in, I mean, it just has, has another another great back in our backfield. Um, and we know as long as we just go out there and give him, give him some holes to run through. I mean, all three of those guys can make big plays. So, I mean, it's, it's obviously great having James James going back for this game. What's it like uh, in the locker room this week? I mean, as far as, you know, you know tough cuff lock, tough tough losses and then this week you guys have an opportunity again to kind of change what's kind of already been written about you you know if you guys can go on a road and you know oh and 16 you yeah, know yeah. going on the road for a while so you know what's the demeanor like in the locker room well i mean today today was great i mean obviously um sunday i mean some, there's a little disappointment i mean obviously uh it's a close game and um but i mean like you said we'd had a had a chance to, to learn from the tcu game and got a good chance against northern illinois this week uh going one on the road all right you got your suit yet uh, yeah, yeah, I was able to get my suit this, over the summer. I had, had a couple of suits. So. Uh, Dwayne was saying he hadn't even got a suit yet. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's, that's, that's Dwayne for you. But no, help, I'm, I'm sure I'll, I'll get one. All right, real quick, who's going to be the best dress? Who's going to be the worst dress? I don't know. I like to think of myself as, as dress, dress pretty good. But, I mean, worst dress? Maybe, maybe Trevor Marigelli. <laughs> That's see. the second time I've heard I that. <laughs> no, I just like to give him a hard time. 